We're going for five hundred thousand dollars, Jason. And here's the question: What is the only continent that does not have a continental divide? Asia, Antarctica, Africa, Australia. D Australia. We're going to make that your my final answer. It's final answer. No, it's not Australia. It's not Australia. Take your time and think about it. Antarctica, Africa, or Asia? Well, I'll say B, Antarctica. Antarctica. Mm-hmm. And that's my final answer. Antarctica. For twenty times your annual salary, you've just won. teacher from North Carolina who has uh, won $500,000. Jason, a half million. Isn't that great? How are you feeling up there, Laura? I am so proud of him. Yeah, sure, you should be. Well, that's great. And I'll bet, I'll bet all of the kids that you teach back there in Valdez are going crazy right now. I huh? bet they are. Oh, my God. So <laughs> what are you going to do with all this money? I'm going to try to save as much of it as I can, but I have to do something a little bit fun with it. And what's fun to you? Fun to me. Going to buy one of these Las Vegas suits? I could buy me several. <laughs> several. Roll your hair red and let it hang long? Okay. Piercing? Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> 500000 We're very, very happy. Thank you. Just want to tell you, remind you, you know, if you miss here, you'll be back to 100000 which is not bad. No. But it's better to get it right and have at least a million dollars, okay? Then let's play, Jason. Here we go. For one million. What song lyric graces the tombstone of the legendary singer Frank Sinatra? Let me sing forevermore. I'll be seeing you. The best is yet to come. Come fly with me. So I'll use my last, last li- lifeline. <laughs> my last lifeline, the three wise men. Uh, you want to confirm then that you want to use the three wise men? You do? All right, well, let's go backstage to our three wise men. Hello, wise people. Hi. How are you feeling? We've you got, got I know that your, your video and audio has been turned off. Very exciting thing here. Jason needs your help. He's going for $1 million right now, so it's very, very important to him, okay? So in a few moments, you will see and hear the question and have 30 seconds to give him your scholarly advice. And here it comes. Your 30 seconds starts now. The question, what song lyric graces the tombstone of Frank Sinatra? Let me sing forevermore. I'll be seeing you. The best is yet to come. Come fly with me. 
think it could be A, but I'm not certain. I would go A or C. Um, a or C? Why C? Um, the message had to come, yeah. you know, heaven. <laughs> so, but I, I think A also could be right. Yeah. And I don't know. Maybe For C, certain. but I'm not certain. <laughs> well, I had to take a chance. Not overwhelming. No. Uh, but what did you think? I thought it was comply with me. Well, these are, you know, four, four great songs we're talking mm -hmm. about here, and Frank could have picked any one of them, mm -hmm. and it would have made sense. And I can't take a chance. I think you I'm gonna, take a I'm chance. gonna keep my 500,000. You're gonna keep your 500,000. <laughs> All right, Jason. Half a million dollars, buddy. Isn't that great? Give me a little hug. Yeah. Feel happy, boy. Thank you. Good luck to you. Thank you. Good luck to you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Just so happy for them. The answer to the question, the best is yet to come. And I think that's true for Jason and Laura as well.